All right, here's a transformer setup. We've got a uh, an X-ray transform a transformer out of an X-ray machine. Um, puts out sixty thousand volts, and um, so I wanted to show what a real sixty thousand volts really looks like. We've got people on there claiming all these high voltages and stuff, and they they don't understand uh, ionization. That, that, you know, ionized gases are conductors, and they'll sit there and strike an arc and pull it out to three inches long and say, oh, I got a hundred thousand volts. No, you don't. And, you know, it just, uh, let me show what that voltage looks like, okay? I've got a ruler here. Okay, that's three inches right there. So we've got three inches between the, uh, between the wires. All right. Oh, that cat out of here. That cat goes crazy when I turn this on. <laughs> See, now that's 60,000 volts. Um, it, it jumps out, you know, out, the, out of the, uh, uh, across the insulator because we don't have the uh, cable plugged in. It, it had a, uh, originally it had a plug that plugs onto here that had a rubber boot that just went down over this and that completely contained the voltage. Right now it's just out in the open. But um, that is 60,000 volts there. But you see it, it you know, you're, we're not pulling an arc. That's an actual spark jumping the th three inches there. And that's what it takes. Now, this is 60 cycles. It's not high-frequency stuff. Uh, what these people are not understanding is that high-frequency <clears throat> causes air to, uh, to ionize at a, at a much lower voltage. And when you, you've got, you know, 30 kilohertz, or, or particularly Tesla coils at a few hundred kilohertz, uh, you know, 50,000 volts will give you a two-foot two arc. And uh, that's, you know, it's, it's not millions of volts like people are claiming. Now, there are some Tesla coils out there that do have a million volts, but those are those ones that you see that, I mean, you know, it's 15 feet of arc there because it's at high frequency. And at, at a million volts, a million volts DC will give you um, a good three-foot spark. But... Um, you know, you take a uh, Tesla coil and a three-foot spark, you know, quite easy at, at 150, 200,000 volts. So uh, you've got to watch out for uh, misinterpreting what, what you're going. Spark length is not a measure of voltage. All right, that's it. This is just a short video to demonstrate that transformer.